2023 Audi Q7. What's the difference versus the 2022 Q7? Audi is upgrading the headlights on virtually every car it sells in the USA this year, the 2023 Q7 included. The Q7 45 TFSI Premium plus trim and all 55 TFSIs receive Matrix Design LED headlights. The base 45 2.0-liter four-cylinder engine is also upgraded with a 12-volt mild hybrid system, and its power output improves from 248 to 261 horsepower. Torque remains unchanged at 273 lbft. The 2023 Q755 Prestige trim gets remote park assist plus. Standard on all trims is a new interior package that covers the dashboard in stitched leatherette. All premium plus trims get stitched leatherette on the center console and armrests. Exterior paint colors are also refreshed, with three metallic colors gone and three new metallics in their place. Satellite silver replaces florid silver, tamarind brown replaces barrel brown, and Waitomo blue replaces galaxy blue. Lastly, when selected for the Q7 45 and 55 premium trims, the optional convenience package now has adaptive cruise control with lane guidance. 2023 Q7 Exterior In terms of looks, the 7-seater Q7 is somewhat restrained, especially when compared to the more muscular BMW X5, but it is well-proportioned and looks pretty good from the front. The premium trim features 19-inch 5 Armstar design wheels, LED headlights with auto high beams, dynamic indicators, a hands-free power liftgate, rear privacy glass, and power-folding exterior mirrors on all trims. All trims above the base 45 premium get matrix design LED headlights. The top-of-the-line prestige includes dual-pane acoustic glass for the front and rear doors. The black optic package adds 20-inch 10-spoke wheels to the 45 Premium Plus, 21-inch wheels on the 55, black roof rails, a black optic grille, front and rear bumper inserts, and black trim around the side windows. This package is offered with the 4-cylinder engine as well, but only on the 45 Premium Plus trim, not on the base 45 Premium. 2023 Q7 Interior Audi has stuck to its guns when it comes to the interior of the 2023 Q7. The German manufacturer has used a sleek and minimalist interior design that looks clean and easy to interact with but can't match the glitzy design inside the Mercedes-Benz GLS. The use of premium materials is extensive, and the build quality is some of the best in this class. The interior room is good, and most adults will find the seating space to be good, but the third row bench gets tight. The seats offer excellent support up front and should remain comfortable, even over long-distance trips. Notable interior features include heated and power-adjustable front seats and three-zone automatic climate control, four-zone in the Prestige. 2023 Audi Q7 trims and specs. There are two 2023 Audi Q7 powertrain configurations and three equipment levels, effectively amounting to five trim levels, 45 Premium, 55 Premium, 45 Premium Plus, 55 Premium Plus, and 55 Prestige. 45 models make use of a 261 horsepower 2.0 liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine and 55 models have a 335 horsepower 3.0 liter turbocharged V6 engine. The base trim comes as standard with 19-inch alloy wheels, automatic LED headlights, power folding and heated side mirrors, a power sunroof, keyless entry with push-button start, a digital gauge cluster, a hands-free power liftgate, three-zone climate control, leather upholstery, heated front seats. 55 models not only gain the V6 engine, but also Matrix design LED headlights. Premium Plus gets more driver assists, 20-inch wheels on the V6, a heated steering wheel, and a better audio system, while Prestige gets air suspension, four-zone HVAC, sunshades, and ventilated seats, among others. The premium trim can be upgraded with some of the higher trim's features but doesn't get access to niceties such as the black optic package, which is only available to the top trims, along with items such as LED laser lights and upgraded interior trim with extended leather. 2023 Q7 Performance 
Don't expect V12 performance levels here, the Audi Q7 is a big car, which takes its toll on performance figures, but most will find that this Audi offers more than enough performance for everyday driving. The Audi 7-seater SUV is powered by two engine options, a turbocharged 2.0-liter 4-cylinder and a turbocharged 3.0-liter 6-cylinder. The 3.0-liter engine produces a healthy 335 horsepower and 369 lb-ft of torque and will do the 0-60 to 60 sprint in only 5.7 seconds. The BMW X5 and 40i guys will do the same sprint in 5.3 seconds. The 2.0-liter 45 TFSI will take 6.7 seconds for the same sprint, and both Q7 derivatives will top out at 130 miles per hour. Both configurations send power to all four wheels. These SUVs can also tow a fair bit, the 45 TFSI Q7 has a towing capacity of 4,400 pounds when properly equipped, while the 3.0-liter 55 TFSI will increase the number to a useful 7,700 pounds. Considering its substantial weight, the Q7 puts in a good effort, especially in 55 TFSI configuration, and most will be more than happy with the way this SUV moves. 2023 Q7 Safety The NHTSA is yet to conduct a full safety review of the Audi Q7, but the 2021 model did receive 5 stars for the side crash and the 2022 and 2023 models 4 stars for the rollover test. The 2023 model fared well on the IIHS test circuit, managing to get good scores for safety categories for all the major crashworthiness tests, although its headlights were disappointingly rated as poor.